All right, folks, today I'm gonna to put together this Lenone 42 inch bar height pub table. I got this on Amazon for my wife, and here's a little picture of that. Um, I got it for around $170. Uh, it's in the Espresso color. Um, there are about four other colors on Amazon, and all of them are 20 to 30, $40 more than this table for some reason. This 42 inch bar height pub table is 47 pounds and the dimensions are 42 inches high 23 inches deep and 27 inches wide so um, and I'll, I'll put it, the dimensions up here as well um, you can set it up in your kitchen in your dining room or in your entryway um, what I'm gonna do is uh, actually this is for my wife and she's gonna use it to set up items that she does unboxings for and take pictures of them so uh, that's why I kind of put it at a, a fairly high level so she can just set up things on the table and then take pictures all right I'm gonna set up over here by the sliding glass doors and unbox this thing um, pull everything out and put it together all right let's go all right so here's the box the bar height pub table uh, arrives in from Amazon um, I'm going to open the box up and pull everything out. All right. All right. There you go. Box is open. Right away, you have the bag of hardware. Um, looks like the manual and instructions taped together here okay manual and instructions let me get the hardware out of here usually the hardware is always in the red packaging inside these boxes it's good to have a razor so you can cut these right off over here now I can pull this out or maybe I fast forward this part I have no idea Let me open this up, see what's inside here. It's gotta be probably the uh, partition type uh, wood in between the legs, I imagine. I do like the uh, the espresso color, though. I don't know if you can see that very well, but I do like the espresso color on this wood, and the wood seems like uh, it's you know real and substantial and strong. This must be a, like a crossbar for the whole for the whole thing. Oh, these are the legs. It is um, sectioned together. Looks like they used bits of other wood. I don't know if you can see that, but where it's put together here 
compress probably and then but it still looks feels strong all right so it looks like what we have here so far are is the top the four legs and some bracing in between so now I'll grab the uh, instructions and get going so this is what the hardware looks like looks like it's going to be um, Allen wrench instead of like Phillips head or flathead screwdriver so they'll probably have you up and have an Allen wrench in here but uh, you know I'll get my own Allen wrench and screw it in my way all right I just checked and these are all 532nd Allen wrench heads so I've got this and I've got this 532nd drill bit uh, that I'm going to use but just keep in mind that you don't want to over tighten so keep in mind of that all right so it looks like the instructions want you to put the legs on first and then these uh, bracings in between uh, last uh, so I will loosely connect all four legs and I'll go around with these other pieces of wood that has braces Might have to fast forward here. I don't know. Take me up to heaven. 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 Yeah, she got me reaching still. Still, still, still. Nothing to stop me falling. Who knew that looks could kill? I don't want to why I'm breathing. Heavy like the weight of it's on my chest. On my chest. Cause it ain't no lie. So when you're screwing these things in, you want to make sure that it's like this. This tab part goes in here and then the screw goes in this position here. And then you want to make sure that on the way this is uh, framed here, there's two holes on the inside of this and then the one hole is on the outside here that you screw in and you want that on all these sides here all right so that's how you want to do it so now all I have to do is tighten all these bolts down uh, I'll do that with the, the drill here um, and again I will not over tighten remember I have to do the legs too I'm done the I haven't even tightened the legs yet Yeah. 
again. I don't want to tighten it too much. Because if I over tighten, it's going to strip something. I don't want to strip anything. Now I want you to put these uh, little wooden blocks in. Little blocks here and they go right in here to close off the space. All right. here it is just completed I just turned it up on the correct end and here's the top that's not bad for an espresso color get to still have a styrofoam on it here and there but very nice hold on a second I'll show you where it's going all right for now it's going right here against this wall I put up this uh, so funny it's an outdoor carpet but I put it up down here in the basement as a background so my wife can place stuff here whatever she unboxes and then take photos however she'd like all right so there you go uh, I'd like to say that that went smoothly but uh, as you can tell it didn't uh, the description in the uh, instruction manual uh, wasn't as detailed as it should have been um, but you know as usual you got to kind of figure it out on your own and I was able to do that um, I just had to you know take a closer look at the different ways these uh, pieces went together uh, the, the good thing is they screwed together very easily um, and it all came together once I <laughs> figured out where everything went uh, it came together pretty quickly uh, and now my wife has this uh, bar height pub table that she's going to be able to use. All right, again, it's the linen 42 inch bar height pub table. It's an espresso color, 47 pounds. It sure is heavy. It's a heavy 47 pounds. <laughs> um, and you can set it up uh, in a lot of different places. Uh, wanted to thank you guys for watching. If you like this uh, video, go ahead and click like. Uh, if you like the channel, go ahead and subscribe. We appreciate you guys subscribing and watching uh, all of our videos. I think I'm up to 170 videos now that I've posted. Um, we just have a lot of fun with it. Um, I even like editing. Isn't that weird? All right, so uh, we appreciate you guys. Hope you guys have a great day. Goodbye. We'll edit that out. <laughs>